This is the stage. It is gorgeous. It does. It does say 2019. Uh, these are all the girls. We're so excited. Ah, this is Presley. I'm vlogging. Oh my goodness. Um, so we're doing a vlog. Uh, when is it going to start? Like 10 yes, minutes. It starts in two minutes. Yes, this is my best friend. I love them so much. Um, these are my people. So I'm Mississippi. Yes, Mississippi and Oklahoma. She's my roommate for the week. Um, I'm crashing her room. And Virginia, second runner. Oh my Friday god, right? <laughs> like what a dub. <laughs> but we are so excited and I'll take little snippets of the competition later. University. I have a degree in communication and a certificate in leadership. From Virginia, I'm Emily McPhail. Blackwell Burton. Hi Emily. The issue of football players kneeling during the national anthem is a divisive one. If you were appointed special counsel to the players, what advice would you give them? I think it's most important to stand up for what you believe in, always. And so kneeling during the national anthem is absolutely a right that you have to stand up for what you believe in and to make the right decision that's right for you. But it's very important that we also take into consideration that it's not about kneeling. It is absolutely about police brutality. Thank you. Yes, queen! Thanks, Virginia. Next is Michaela Hushaw, Iowa. It's time to award some scholarships. Ernst & Young has been tabulating the judges' scores each night of the competition. The winner of a $1,000 scholarship for interview and on-stage interview is... Miss Virginia! On the boardwalk. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Um, oh my god, we went to the wrong floor. So, wait, I thought we went to one. How did we go to the... Oh, we went to two. Um, it is like eight-ish in the morning. Wow, there's mirrors all around. And we're about to go get breakfast at the hotel. Beefist. Because, you know, hungry girls, big girls gotta eat. <laughs> so and then we have a full day of adventures. We are going Helping to... the community and stuff. Yes, we are going to a food bank um, in New Jersey with New Jersey's that same teen. Also, casino vibes. Also, illegal vibes. <laughs> uh, and then we're getting lunch somewhere in Atlantic City. And then the Miss American memorabilia. Yeah. And then mini golfing. So kind of a lot going on. Also, I always just look like at the screen, not the camera. So oops. <laughs> um, but we have our sashes and we're ready to go. So I'll take little vids throughout. We are back. We got coffee because you can't be up this early in the morning without coffee. No. And we are about to walk out to the boardwalk to meet the other girls before we go to the food bank. On the boardwalk, the nice 
views. It's so pretty. It's actually I'm really honestly obsessed with it here. Yeah, but also right now since it's not too, it's like not too early where it's cold, but it's not too late in the afternoon where it's blazing heat. It's like the perfect weather. Yeah, I love the humidity. It's one of my favorite weathers. Weathers. Is that like a weather? That's one of my favorite weathers. <laughs> is, is, is it counted as a weather? I don't think it's counted as a weather. What is um, it? Everybody what say is hi it? to. <laughs> Our gorilla friend. Uh, but the boardwalk is a short walk from our hotel, so we'll be there in a hot second. For the day. Yes, yeah, I'm also yeah. getting my arm exercised by holding this up. Mm -hmm. But we will see you guys in a hot second. Oh, I'm sorry now. Sorry. Everybody, we're back. Um, so we're at the food bank. Oh, I'm vlogging. Oh my gosh, love vlogging. I'm making love a YouTube that. video of my week here. We both are. Yes, I think it's we great. both are. Uh, we're at the New Jersey. Is this the New Jersey food bank? Yeah. Okay. New Jersey food bank in Atlantic City. They provide food for three counties in New Jersey. We just got to hear a little bit about it, and we'll be helping out here today, sorting food, packaging food, all that fun stuff. Um, and it's even better that we get to do it as sisters. Um, <laughs> we love that. <laughs> uh, but we are very excited. And then after this, we're gonna have. Have a fun little lunch and then go to the Miss America memorabilia. So we'll come back. Go for it. We love the Beauty Food Bank. Miss America. Hey everyone, we are at lunch. Mr. Sip. Oh. <laughs> at Tony's, a Baltimore grill in Atlantic City. We're eating pizza and salad, and they were kind enough to have us. So, say hi. What's your YouTube, Emily? Oh, my Emma, YouTube is technically YouTube the username is Beauty by Emmy26. Oh, you got a makeup tutorial? Um, back in the day, I made YouTube videos in like middle school. Wait, Beauty by Probably. I have a YouTube yeah. account. So it's Beauty by Emmy26, but now it just says Emily Kinsey because you can put your name. Right now we are getting ready for night three of Miss America prelims. I'm about to curl my hair. Sydney's doing her <laughs> makeup. <laughs> and yep, we're gonna get all glam. Hello everybody! We are on our way to Miss America prelims night three. You're only night two. Yeah, only my night two, but technically it's night three. I have my Emily McPhail face with me. I have to give a shout out to Reflections Pageant and Prom for my dress tonight. I have to give them a shout out. They were so sweet and loaned me all the dresses that I'm wearing here. And I'm wearing a beautiful gown tomorrow, so you guys will get to see that. But we are going to try and snag a front row seat again tonight. Fingers um, crossed, so fingers crossed that that works out. We'll keep you updated. That's a chance for our young competitors here to voice their voices and to get their message out. <laughs> Emily McPhail, Virginia. <laughs> What do you have on your mind? Call your legislator, donate a can, or give an hour. Together we can end hunger, our country's most solvable problem. Thank you. We are at a visitation right now. Miss America prelims just ended, so the Miss contestants will be coming up. Oh, candidates will be coming out soon. Um, and I'd like to introduce you to a special friend of mine. Uh, this is Barbie Sydney. Uh, Miss Oklahoma's out Sydney. Miss Oklahoma's out Sydney team. See the resemblance. It's quite remarkable. I want one of my own. I'm gonna make you one. Oh, 
Thank you. You're welcome. I don't know how to make a Barbie, but I will make one. But we'll find out. I'm sure there's a DIY somewhere. You know? <laughs> there is DIY. There always is. We're going to dinner after this, and then I'm going to sleep. I'm getting mini corn rolls. Love that for you. Bye. It is Saturday afternoon now. It's we. We went to bed at like pretty, two. Yeah, at like two. <laughs> Woke up at 11 a.m. And now we're headed to go get coffee. I need a bottle of water. I'm so thirsty. And hi, hi, Rodney. <laughs> um, that was Rodney. He was our security guard at. This mayor is not seeing teen, and also like still our security guard when here. we're around him. So yeah. here. Um, but then after we get coffee, we're gonna go to the Miss America trade show, and I'm hopefully gonna get some earrings to wear for finals night with my gown. Yeah. Pack any that match. I didn't pack any that match. Um, that's kind of an issue. It's fine. But we'll see if there's any other goodies there. Yeah. That's see you guys there. Extremely lost is an understatement. Uh, we have no idea. We where ended we up are. like in the kitchen of this <laughs> place. Oh, I got my water. Um, like I also had a chai tea latte, the but I drank like, that oh, already. Go. <laughs> so we were trying to find the trade show. We don't know can't find the trade me. show. <laughs> oh my god, it's in Traymore. Oh, that's we why we went to the wrong. wrong okay, New York Fashion Week. Who? Mm. We just left the trade show. Yeah. I have some goodies in my hand. I got earrings. I got earrings. For finals night, which weren't too expensive, which yeah, I was pleasantly was surprised about. Ten dollars, and they're yeah, really cute. Yeah, and so. they're really cute. So we are. We could get a one dollar hot dog. Love that. We're it's hungry. Not <laughs> but we're trying to find an umbrella at like a some random store here. Yeah. Because we're in the parade, the Miss America iconic Show Me Your Shoes parade. We're I'm in not. it. But it's supposed to rain, and they didn't really like prepare us for that. Do you want to keep walking down there and see if there are any stores with yeah. umbrellas? Okay. And so I think what we're gonna do now is go find an umbrella, maybe grab some grub, like sh inhale it, and then go get ready because we're really. It's not literally two o'clock, and we have to be there ready at three <laughs> thirty. Hi. Hey guys, we are on a bus right now. I am. Oh my gosh! This is London's shoe that she's taking in the Show Me Your Shoes parade. She looks so cute. She has Phantom of the Opera theme. Oh, thank you. Um, but we are on the bus getting ready to walk in the Show Me Your Shoes parade. In the rain. In the rain. It's going to be a great time. Everybody's hair is going to go crazy. We're going to wear our clear ponchos. We got the umbrellas. Um, we got it figured out. Yeah, so stay tuned, y'all. Everybody say hi to the vlog! Hi, I'm Lisa! Um, it is raining! Like, torrential downpours! Well, that's a little bit of an exaggeration, but it's also windy and freezing. Like, my umbrella is not working. Right now, we are headed to Rainforest Cafe. I forgot to put a bra on. Good. Just leaving the best <laughs> We're headed to Rainforest Cafe. We finished the parade. I don't know. I got a clip of before we started actually walking the parade, but we were outside, so you probably already saw that. Apparently, they don't have many corn dogs here. And don't. <laughs> City's a little pressed about a it. A little. <laughs> when I went, there were many corn dogs. So I don't know what this location's about, but but they I'll, do have dinosaur-shaped ch chicken nuggets. So so that's kind of a mood, but I'll I'll keep you guys updated on what Sydney ends up ordering. Can I have grilled chicken with a side of lettuce? <laughs> um, comment below if you know what that reference is to. Yeah, me too. Secured the ice cream, and now. We are going back to the room. She's going to go get a picture with the Miss America statue back there. There's the scram. Oh! <laughs> In the rain. She's literally asking him to take a picture. <laughs> She's <gasps> asking. He's doing it. He's doing it. <laughs> oh. He's literally squatting. <gasps> He's killing it. And now we move locations. Welcome back. You really did that. He goes. 
You look fabulous. <laughs> Hello everyone. Currently, Cameron is teasing my hair because she's doing it for finals night. It looks pretty sick, honestly, from the side. Like, yeah. I'm kind of living like for it. Model. We are at Miss America finals. We just got here. We actually just got interviewed by the Atlantic City Press and oh. <laughs> it's fine. It's oh. fine. Oh. Oh. <laughs> um, we just got interviewed by the Atlantic City Press and we got our photo taken by another oh, yeah, another press member of some sort and we are currently waiting for my ticket so I can get in. Uh, wow, you can't even see my crown from the light. I know. But, um, oh, thank you Reflection, common pageant, for my gown. I will take a video once we actually get the venue. And the new Miss America receives $50,000 in scholarship, begins a year-long job, and her life will be changed forever. Oh, now, here we go. <laughs> I got a little excited. The first runner-up is Bridget Orr! 